is TFNN, the Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN, headline news update. Good morning, everyone. Basil Chapman here on this last day of January, Monday, January the 31st. And here's the Tiger Financial News Network 10 a.m. market update. The Dow is now down only 14 points. I say only 14 points at 34,712 because there was a spectacular move in the last hour of Friday. My rule of thumb is when there's a move in the last hour that is kind of aberrational to most of the day, Normally, the next day, you give back about 20% of that, maybe 20 to 30%. Well, <clears throat> the Dow futures can show that. Look what happened. The Dow futures, huge move on Friday. Overnight from Sunday night, it was up again, went to 34,712, and then slid all the way down to 34,313, 400 points down. Now we're coming back, we're slightly up, and that's a big positive. And I had also mentioned that that fourth session since the Monday a week ago low, that's usually where I like to see a big breakout for leg B. Well, we had a spectacular close on Friday, but it, it was not great. But in the scheme of things, <clears throat> it's really important that we get some follow through today because if we get follow through to the upside today, that is very important. So let's go to the S&P. The S&P right now is up 21. That's a good percentage, a good point gain. Uh, it's at 4453.99. And the high on Friday was 4453.23. So we have, yeah, so now we're starting a leg B. And that really is important because you want to see off a low that was at 4222, some kind of, strength that keeps following through with the volatility index starting to pull back sharply, which is down. It's down um, at 2738 from the 38.94 high of um, just a week ago. This is starting to show some deterioration in the volatility of the sentiment. So let's go to QQQ, one, two, three, there we go. Nice move up, this is a good change. Up almost six points at 357, nice move. IWM, is that following through? Yeah, but it's still very, very weak. Looking at gold, <clears throat> gold is up 10, but still very weak. And the dollar, where's the dollar? We'll talk about and crude oil is holding. I think crude is going to slip a little bit here. We'll talk about that when I get back for my Tiger Technician's Hour. Basil Chapman, 